I hope you enjoyed our story yesterday called A Squiggly Story. I have some comprehension questions that I want to ask you to make sure that you understood the story. So the first page we're gonna go to is page nine. It was this part of the story. And the question is, why does the sister say, it's your story, you're the boss? Remember whenever he's saying that he's stuck and, he, and she says that, that he has a good beginning but he doesn't know what goes next? And he, she says, well, it's your story. You're the boss. Why does she say that? I want you to answer these questions with your parents. You don't have to record them, but I want you to talk about the questions with your parents. Okay, here's the next question. Are the boy and his sister really playing soccer on the beach? Are the boy and his sister really playing soccer on the beach? And then the next question was from this page. This is after he has sh uh, shared the, his story with the class, his friends in class. Why does everyone keep asking the boy what happens next? Remember all the friends in his class kept saying, what happens next? Why do they keep asking that? So after you're finished answering those questions, I also want you to talk to your parents about the characters of a squiggly story, the setting of the squiggly story. Remember, characters means who was in the story, and setting means where did the story happen and when did the story happen. And then I want you to talk to your parents about the main events of the story, what happened at the beginning of the story, the middle of the story, and the end of the story.